This is How to Grow Spirulina. Before you get your live spirulina culture, you'll need a clean container of some kind, ideally one that's transparent, sterile distilled water or filtered water that doesn't have any chlorine in it, salts in the form of sodium bicarbonate, aka baking soda. This gets your water alkaline and pH up. Nutrients to feed your spirulina. The main macronutrients are nitrogen, phosphorus, and potassium. Finally, you'll need live spirulina culture. Next, the right environmental conditions. pH level between 10.5 and 11, but a range of 8 to 11 is okay, not ideal. Temperature between 80 to 90 degrees Fahrenheit, but 65 to 100 is okay, but you're pushing the limits. Light and dark periods, 12 hours on, 12 hours off is normal. Provide indirect sunlight while still establishing and three hours of full direct sunlight after it's mature. Spirulina needs both CO2 and oxygen for photosynthesis during the day and respiration at night. You should agitate or aerate your spirulina three to five times a day by swirling it or passing bubbles through it to increase gas exchange. Distribute light throughout the container and mix nutrients. Finally, the solution should remain clean with no competing organisms like the introduction of other bacteria or cyanobacteria craving predators other than yourself. And that is how to grow spirulina.